Well, for one of those moving today, the timing couldn't be better. It's very exciting, actually, to be moving in. Um, I was in the hospital before this and living on the street before that. So this is definitely, like, wow to me. Uh, good morning and welcome. Welcome to the village. Welcome to the tiny homes village. And boy, it feels good to be able to see that. Uh, my name's Alan Saunders. I'm chair of the board of Our Place Society. And uh, our gathering has already begun as Joseph has been smudging the area. Thank you, Joseph. It's always very much appreciated. As you know, Our Place Society uh, acknowledges with respect the, uh, the Guangwen-speaking peoples of the uh, Songhees and Esquimalt nations, as well as the Saanich nations, as we uh, offer on their traditional and ancestral territories programs and services. Friends, today we have a blessing. And we have it because today is a good day. In fact, today is a great day. Any day that 30 people find shelter and nurture and uh, a warm welcome and so much more, that's a fantastic day. And so we come to celebrate because Although this village is talking about homes that are tiny, the significance of it is huge. Because not only does it provide shelter and so much more in the here and now, but also it is an important bridge towards the goal of permanent housing. And so that's something that we want to celebrate this day. We celebrate those who have taken part in the visioning and the teamwork in uh, the commitment to making this day possible and for the village to have a physical presence this morning. Later today, we will be welcoming uh, our first residents here. And uh, some of the neighbors have uh, anticipated that by uh, bringing flowers, some of which are located right here. And so we want to celebrate not only the village, but also every initiative that is seeking to improve the situation for those who are amongst the many of our city's most vulnerable citizens. Our Place Society, which is managing the project, says its first priorities are pretty clear. A lot of people who are just not sure what to expect. So making sure that people are feeling safe, making sure that people know where things are, um, making sure people understand the guidelines for the community and also trying to ask people to build the community with us. 